All right, great, thanks. Thank you, Mr. Chair. I also wanted to take this opportunity to thank all the veterans for your services to our uh, nation and most cases to keep peace uh, uh, around the globe. You know, I came from a veteran family. My father was one of the flying tigers and uh, fought uh, uh, side, to, side by side or a flight uh, 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 over the hump with the uh, General Chenault and, and, and his team. And my grandfather on my mother's side was also, uh, 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 was actually trained in, in, uh, uh, by the United States. He was one of the distinguished uh, um, alumni from uh, BMI, Virginia Military Institute. And he led the ground troop and side by side uh, was uh, General Stilwell and opened up uh, and, and leading the Chinese troops and opened up the Lido uh, uh, Highway. I don't know if you are familiar with the part of history in World War II in the CBI theater. So I, I, I know that uh, uh, arts and the expressing art therapy uh, 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 such as music and art and, and poetry have been, sh uh, it works for uh, positively, positively impact the emotion and help with the PTSD. I look forward to hearing from the veterans and their families on how art therapy has helped them. I think that's a really, really good testimony. And most importantly, I'm interested in learning how California can best use our resources the California Arts uh, Council, uh, I see the, uh, the EDs here, and the Department of uh, Veterans Affairs to meet the need of our veterans. With that, again, thank you, Senator Allen, for putting this hearing together and uh, for all the witnesses who come forward to share your personal experiences.